Hey everyone, if you have a website or service that offers users to upload videos, then you may want to look at the Microsoft Video Indexer to give you extra insights into the And in this video, I'll explore the Video Indexer service and show all the cool things you can do with it. So the first thing here is I'm at the Video Indexer site, at videoindexer.ai, and you need a Microsoft account to log in with. And so already, I've already done that. And first thing you need to do is to upload a video. And, and you can either upload a file on your uh, local file system, or you can enter a URL for the file. And when you enter the URL for the file, it has to be the direct file itself, not just like a YouTube video or anything. So I'm going to upload a file here. I'm going to upload this uh, mo.net CLI video I did a couple weeks ago. And we're going to let that um, upload real quick. All right, now finished uploading. And now it's indexing the video. So it's performing those analytics on the video. And once it finishes, we can look at all those analytics that, that it does for us. All right, this video finished analyzing. So we'll go into it real quick. And on this screen here, we got the video here and then all the insights on the right side. So the first thing we have is we got all the different topics that it finds within the audio of the video. So we're talking machine learning, uh, data analysis, uh, let's see, what else? Uh, housing prices, which is what our data set is, mortgages. So I went through all that and I figured out all the, the topics that I found. And right down here is where, so this big data is highlighted. We can go through each of them. And down here, this is kind of the link to the video. And the, each of these boxes here is where this topic is mentioned. And so if we go down to, let's see, housing, this whole block here mentions the housing data set that I was talking about. Further down, we have some labels. And the labels here is just kind of what uh, things that are defined within the video itself. So the topics is what's in the audio of the video. The labels is what, if, what it can find within the video itself. And then we go down to sentiment and it adds uh, which parts of the video have positive sentiment and which ones have negative sentiment. And the, the gray parts are neutral sentiment. So I've got some a little bit of negative sentiment here but otherwise not too bad. All right, so other than that, we have this timeline here. And what this is, is a transcript that I found from all the audio. And what I can do, I can download this transcript in the insights itself as a JSON file, and then the transcripts can come whatever uh, file format that it needs to be. So if I wanted to, I can download this transcript file that are generated here. And then in YouTube, I can upload it there. And then I'll kind of have a, a basic closed cap. If you look down here, if we wanted, we can actually translate transcript here into a different language. So if I want this to be French, I just click on French and now all the transcript has been translated into French and I can download that as well. So go back to English. We can go through here uh, manually and if we see something that we can update here. So, so down here, the have and the aren't spaced. So I can go here to the edit, go within here and edit right there. And, and then I'll micro save the transcript there. Now there's some other things that it's not showing you here because there's no there's no faces or anything within uh, this video. So but if there were, it'll try to figure out who the people are within the video. And, you know, if it's somebody famous, like, uh, like the Microsoft CEO, that it all might automatically tag them within the videos. And then, like down here, it'll tell you what parts they are shown in the video. But that's pretty much it. It's a, a good service to to show, kind of get some 
for insights on, on your videos. So something interesting to look at within your video is kind of, so you can see kind of the sentiment, uh, if there's a lot of negative sentiment in your videos and stuff like that. So that's it. That's kind of the, just a quick video to show you this service. And until next time.